This is Nutty Sports Gamer, and you are watching episode 27 of my 40 year NBA sim on NBA 2K23. We are in the second round of the 1987 playoffs, and these are the matchups. Some pretty good matchups here Nuggets, Lakers. Let's check out this game one here. See if this is a game that could be interesting. It won't be. 113 79 is the final score there. Magic Johnson and James Worthy are the leaders in points in this game. And the Nuggets just couldn't handle the Lakers' offense, and they couldn't score. So that is a 1-0 series for the Lakers. As we see if the Bullets, Pistons, possible good game. Nope. Bullets win that game. However, Rockets, Mavericks... This could be a game we're jumping into. 89-88 is the score. Rolando Blackman makes that long two. Ralph Sampson fires back with a bucket right there. One point game. Ron Harper. No, Derek Harper to James Donaldson with the bucket. Shrimp with the dunk. 93-92. Harper pulls up. Makes the jumper. Mark Aguirre makes this shot right here. Check out this replay of Aguirre confusing his defender, outworking him to the bucket, to the basket. Rav Sampson receives this pass. He's going to lay this in over Charles Barkley. Derek Harper to Donaldson with the bucket. And then any four. Rockets could score, as evidenced by that uh, basket by Ralph Sampson, but they cannot stop the Mavericks as uh, that three-pointer is drained. And a steal there, Bar Barkley with the tip. And here come the Mavericks. Derek Harper passing it to Mark Aguirre, who drives the lane, nearly loses the ball, gets blocked there. So the Rockets, things aren't quite over for them yet. As if they have a chance here to do something interesting. Bob McAdoo, who's on the Rockets, uh, makes that shot. 102.98. Block shot there, and the Rockets are once again in transition. Bob McAdoo again. <laughs> Where the hell did he come from all of a sudden? Making some clutch shots. Derek Harper, though. That's a killer. 104 100 with the final score here, and the Dallas Mavericks would take game one. But it was cool to see Bob McAdoo, right? <laughs> He's on the Rockets. I forgot about that. And uh, yeah, Mavericks fire back. Or shots fired by the, by the Mavericks here in this series. They take game one. And let's see if uh, Sixers Celtics game one, perhaps, might be a game we could check out. Sixers are up by five with six minutes left to go. And Kevin McHale is going to make that basket. And now it's a three-point game. Tony misses. And Sam Bowie makes that shot. Sisting with this bucket right here. I used to think it was Sickting, but then I heard Harlan say Sisting. So I guess it's Sisting. Sixers make that shot. 118-115. Irving... Baseline misses, gets this put back here. Five point game. Celtics, Larry Burr pulls up, makes that shot. 120, 117, three and a half left to go. And an alley oop, Roy Hinson. Hinson makes that, makes that shot. Larry Bird posting up. Dr. J makes that, makes that basket. Cheeks to Tony. It's good. Still a five-point game. Tony. Now a three-point game. Passes it to Sam Bowie. Who could make this a six-point game with this free throw. And he does just that. 127-121. Larry Bird with the long two. Andrew Tony fires back with the jumper. Back to a six-point game. Danny Ainge loses the ball. Tony gets it. Draws the foul. 131 to 123. The Philadelphia 76ers will take game one at the Garden. Bet you didn't expect that. 
Kevin McHale, 31 and 10. Larry Bird, 28 points, 14 assists. Andrew Tony with 29 points. Irving will be will be free both at 23. And I consider this a a trilogy of sorts. My very first video has Dr. J and Larry Bird as a thumbnail. And then another video of mine, I think in the 85 season, also has Dr. J and Larry Bird. This might be the last time we get to have that. So I think that will be the thumbnail for this video. You already know that because you clicked on it. But I don't know that yet. Because I'm in the past and you're in the future. 134-107. Uh, Lakers beat the Nuggets. So they're up 2-0 pretty easily. This looks like it's not going to be much of a contest. Let's see about Pistons. Bullets. Bullets seem to have a commanding lead. Pistons can't seem to score. 107 80 is the final score there. So the Bullets are up 2-0. The Lakers are up 2-0. And round two is a bit of a bust. I'll, I'll just let the cat out of the bag. Round two is a bit of a bust. It's the conference finals that are... That's why you should tune into this video. 130-107 here is this score. Mavericks over Rockets. Uh, we're just trying to get to the conference finals because that is where things get spicy. Celtics, Sixers. The Celtics will take this game, 132-110. So I believe we only have one second round matchup that's tied at one. Here, the Lakers will take game three of this series against the Nuggets. Pistons, Bullets in Detroit at the Palace. And here, this time around, the Pistons will take game three at home, 111-197. So, that series isn't quite as over as the Western Conference series seem to be. Mavericks, Rockets. Looks like the Mavericks are going to take over this game and win it 128 114 is the final score there mark mcguire had 35 points so the mavericks are up 3-0 the lakers are up 3-0 how about sixers celtics game three right 120 106 there it's the final score there yep so the celtics are up 2-1 the nuggets actually win game four 93 88 so they are not out yet Let's check out uh, Bullets Pistons at the Palace. This looks like a game we can check out. Cliff Robinson draws the foul here. And with this free throw, it's an eight-point game. He misses. Green with the rebound. And nice to see some Pistons action. We've we barely seen the Pistons in the playoffs because they, they swept the Bulls. And now uh, their games against the Bulls have been contest. But this one might be a good one. Isaiah Thomas makes that shot. John Stockton pulls up for the J, makes it. Seven-point game. The Pistons are going to need some stops. Isaiah Thomas with the layup. 105-100. Dantley to Ron Harper with the dunk. Three-point game now. Here we go. Ron Harper again. Another dunk. 105-104. Less than three left to go. John Stockton pulls up. Misses. Green with the rebound. So here we go. The Pistons have a chance to take the lead. Isaiah Thomas to Ron Harper. Passing it to Greenwood. Gets it to Isaiah Thomas. Whoa, uh, no. No, no, no. Bad, bad, bad. Stockton with the steal and the bucket. 107-104. Dantley. Back it down as defender. McDaniel makes that basket. Rulin misses. Isaiah Thomas with the rebound. Let's see if the Pistons can take the lead here. As Thomas tries to penetrate, he makes this basket. 108 107. The Pistons with the lead. Billy and Beer with the rebound there. And the Pistons have a chance to add to the lead here. Isaiah Thomas dribbles, drives, makes the layup. 110 107. Here's a replay of the layup as Isaiah Thomas gets past his defender and gets the bucket. Cliff Robinson. On Lambeer, he loses the ball and Beer steals it. Ron Harper drives, pulls up, misses the shot. Maybe don't pull up for that shot. You know, you didn't have to do that, kid. As uh, low misses and the foul is drawn, intentional foul. And that might do it. Isaiah Thomas makes these free throws. Final score would be 115 110. 
Isaiah Thomas with 29 points. Dantley with 29 points. Bill and Beer at 18. Ron Harper with 11. Vinny Johnson with 10. Pistons aren't dead yet. They tied the series at 2-2-2. Two, two, two. So, might have thought this series, uh, the Bulls were, Bulls were running away with it, but they don't. Rockets are eliminated from the postseason as the Mavericks beat them in four games. Let's check out this one here. Game four, Celtics, Sixers. Dr. J cut steps at five. We have five minutes left. Mikhail misses, gets his own rebound, gets the bucket. Seven-point game. Robert Parrish, crazy shot, but gets his own rebound and dunk. Will be freeze out there. Let's see if he can provide a spark. He makes that shot. Back to his home point game. Robert Parrish with the dunk here. World be free. Misses. Rebound Celtics. Here they come. Dennis Johnson. Spin move. Pulls up. Misses. And Robert Parrish with the dunk right there. 109. 100 now. Larry Bird. Turns around. With the fade away. And that will do it. The Boston Celtics will go ahead and win this game. Get a 3-1 lead against the Sixers. Will be free. Had a good game, but it wasn't enough. It was in a losing effort. And Michael Cage only had two rebounds, which is not ideal. Larry Bird, 29, 14, and 12. And so they have a 3-1 lead. Nuggets, Lakers. Nuggets win yet another game. So that's interesting. Um... Let's see the box score. Worthy at 34. The final score is 108, 106, 106, 103. Looks like it's the final score. Alex English had 36 points. So maybe we'll jump into game uh, six of that one. Pistons, Bullets. Like I said, round two isn't the best. It's rounds one and one, and rounds rounds three that are. Uh, Round one and one, round three, that, that are the good ones. Bullets win game five as I ramble and stop myself from rambling much more. As we can check out this potential elimination game. Sixers missed that shot. Larry Bird with the rebound, and here they come. The Celtics, Bird to Mikhail for the bucket. Four-point game. Bo Cheeks to Sam Bowie makes that shot. Two-point game. This is close. Intentional foul, though. Probably not necessary. I don't know why they would do that. Why would you do that? 124-120. There's plenty of time left. You could have just played defense and tried to get the ball back. Instead, yikes. Another steal there. We got a steal there. 128-120 is going to be the final score. And the Boston Celtics will go on. We'll go back to the Eastern Conference Finals to face either the Pistons or the Bullets. And, yeah. I mean, they're the defending champions, and they're back in the Eastern Conference Finals. So that is... Uh, are you surprised? <laughs> I mean, the Sixers won that first game, but the Celtics just took over from there. That was that. Nuggets, though, look at this. They're actually giving the Lakers a run for their money in game six but the lakers have taken over let's see if they can seal the deal and make it to the western conference finals michael thompson misses that shot but kareem abdul jabbar gets the put back it's weird to see them both on the court at the same time um i guess that works for them i don't know as uh magic johnson passes it to kareem where he has the ball dunks it 116, 107, and oh yeah, this looks like this game might be over already. Nuggets get that shot right there. Byron Scott misses, but Worthy with the rebound. 118, 109. Dan Issel, the missile. I think he retires after this season, by the way. I don't want to make you sad, but it's going to happen. It's going to be prepared emotionally. Michael Cooper with the rebound there. 118, 111. And yes, it looks like the Lakers are going to Go back to the conference finals yet again. And Magic Johnson makes that shot. 122, 111. This is over. Nuggets missed that shot. And that is it. The Nuggets have been eliminated, but hey, 
Still appreciate them eliminating the, the Clippers. That was funny. And the Lakers are going to be facing the Mavericks for the third season in a row. We'll see what happens there. That is becoming a bit of a rivalry, huh? Three straight Western Conference Finals with the Mavericks and the Lakers. And now let's see if the Bullets, for the first time since, what, 78 or 79, are going to make the Eastern Conference Finals. I know they won it in 78. They won the whole thing in 78. And yes, they will indeed make the Eastern Conference Finals to face the Boston Celtics. So Celtics, Bullets, Lakers, Mavericks. And now here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Mostly gentlemen, I assume. This is the shit. All right. So, okay. Celtics, Bullets, Game 1. Looks like the Celtics are going to take care of this one kind of easily. 147-109. Good Lord. Danny Age with 39 points. 10 assists. John Stockton with 23 and 10. So Celtics win that game. Let's see what happens here. Lakers. Mavericks, 80-71. to 71. Lakers have a 9-point lead. Let's see if the Mavericks try to make a comeback here. 80-73 to 73 after that Guire bucket. Magic misses that shot, but gets the putback. 82-75 now. Less than 9 minutes left to go in the game. Magic Johnson is going to get that finger roll to go. Here's Johnson again. Johnson passing it to Kareem. Makes that basket. 86-75. Mark Aguirre passing it out to James Donaldson. It makes the baseline jumper. 86-77. Mark Aguirre top of the key. Passing it to Joe Dumars. With Byron Scott on him. He makes or misses, his, uh, misses that shot. Makes that bucket. Let's check out a replay of Joe Dumars as a Maverick with this play. Gets his own rebound. The hustle and the bustle. And here's Dumars again. Misses this time. And the Lakers are in transition. And Byron Scott is going to get that dunk. 88-79. Derek Harper misses. James Allenson gets the dunk off the rebound. Kareem makes the shot. So the Lakers can't be stopped on offense. The Mavericks can't get a stop on defense. Mark Aguirre makes that shot. But as long as uh, the Lakers are scoring, it doesn't really matter much. Barkley gets a rebound here. Gets blocked by James Worthy. And here come the Lakers yet again. Magic Johnson passing it to Cooper. And now they can just kind of like ice this game. Byron Scott makes that shot. 96-88 now with less than two minutes left to go in the game. And we got a Magic Johnson bucket. Final score, 104-93. And yeah, Mark Aguirre, 24 points, 9 rebounds. Charles Brook with 21-13 in a losing effort. Lakers take the 1-0 series lead. A crucial game on the road. Crucial victory for the Lakers. And Magic Johnson with 35, 9, and 6. Kareem with 22 points. The old man still got it. And this might be a cool thumbnail, but I think I've already no. Yeah, I've already I've already agreed with myself that I should make the thumbnail of Dr. J and Larry Bird. But uh that one's not, that one's a good one too. That one's a good one too. But uh yeah. That is that, and it looks like this game is close. Game two, Eastern Conference Finals. 114, 111, less than four minutes left to go in the game. Rebound there for the Celtics. As Age gets the layup there. Five point game. John Stockton in the corner there. Drives the baseline. Makes that shot. Kind of a wild circus shot right there. Check this out. He's got Dennis Johnson on him, and it doesn't matter. He makes the bucket regardless. Three minutes left to go in the game. Robert Parrish with Cliff Robinson on him. And Parrish is going to make that basket. 118-113. Parrish yet again doing work. Missing and then dunking. Seven-point game now. Bullets are in trouble. Stockton. With the alley-oop to Xavier McDaniel. Maybe that could turn things around. 
for the Bullets, but the Celtics have answers to the Bullets' offense. And that's a miss by Xavier McDaniel from three. And that is pretty much going to do it, I would think. Here is uh, Ainge to seal things. 124-115 is the final score there. The Celtics have a 2-0 lead. I know I, I know I said this is the shit. You'll see. You'll see. I know you think it's over. But uh, all right, I should stop talking. I, 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 I don't want to spoil anything. 98-88. Game 2. Now it's 98-96. Dallas with a little bit of a comeback here in this game. Game 2 at Dallas. They, they really need to win this game. The Mavericks really need to win this game at home. Let's see if they can. Derek Harper pulls up, makes the jumper. 198, four and a half left to go. Magic Johnson is going to draw the foul. And with these free throws, it'll be, oh, he makes one of two, I think. So 101-98 now. Dumars uh, to Aguirre. That's a miss. Barkley with the rebound and put back. Barkley again draws the foul. Can take the lead. The Mavericks can with these Barkley free throws. There is one. And Sir Charles make the second one. 102, 101. Magic Johnson is going to pass it to Michael Thompson for the for the bucket. Mark Aguirre now passing it to Charles Barkley. Makes the shot. 104, 103. Mavericks steal for the Mavericks. Who are in transition. And that is going to be a missed shot. So a really missed opportunity for the Mavericks to take advantage of the turnover. Magic Johnson to James Worthy. And that is an alley-oop. 105-104. Two minutes left to go. Barkley against Worthy. Turns around, makes a jumper. Mavericks retake the lead. And here they are in transition. Harper with the layup. 108, 105. Check out the replay. Derek Harper makes the layup. Smooth. Joe Dumars now passing it out to Donaldson. Harper receives the ball. Pulls up. Misses the shot. And here come the Lakers. Byron Scott dribbling the ball. Lakers have to make something happen here. As Magic Johnson will make the baseline shots. 108, 107. Mavericks. Joe Dumars gets the bucket and one. Perhaps. Yes, he does. 111, 107 is the score. 37 seconds left to go. And Magic Johnson is going to get this shot in the paint to make it a two point game. Steal. Really bad pass there. By the Mavericks. The Lakers have a chance to tie things up. Byron Scott to Magic Johnson. Misses the shot. James Donaldson with a rebound. He passes it off to Derek Harper who gets fouled. And with these free throws, Derek, uh, Derek Harper can seal the game. Most likely. Unless. Unless. No. Michael Cooper misses that shot. Intentional foul, 115-111 is the final score, and the Mavericks do tie the series at 1. Charles Brock with 28-12, and 12. Mark Aguirre with 39 points, Derek Harper, Derek Harper with 25. Yeah, ooh, Blackman had, was 0-9 in the game, by the way, not good. James Worthy, 25 points, Magic Johnson with the triple-double, Michael Thompson with 19 points, and that series is getting pretty interesting. Boston versus Washington. The Bullets will not be denied here. They will take game three. 2 1 series now. 118 uh, 112 is the final score there. And let us check out this game, game three at the Forum. Lakers are up by six. And let us check this out. Magic Johnson drives, makes the shot. 108 100. Check out the replay. Magic looking good. Driving the lane. Harper pulls up. Misses. Donaldson gets the rebound and the bucket. Back to a six point game. Worthy. Fakes. Makes a shot. 
110, 102. Aguirre against Worthy. He gets the shot to fall. Mavericks now get the ball back. And here comes Charles Barkley with the shot off glass. 110, 106. Two and a half left to go. Michael Cooper passes it out to Byron Scott. Magic Johnson receives the ball. Shot clock winding down. Three, two. Pulls up for the three. Not really his shot. The Mavericks have a chance now to cut this to one possession. Derek Harper. To Mark Aguirre with the alley-oop. And it is indeed 110-108. Magic Johnson now. Double teamed. Cooper. Makes that shot. 112-108. Derek Harper. Going to drive the baseline. Make that bucket. 112-110. Magic Johnson with his baby hook. 114, 110. So Lakers have answers to every Mavericks bucket, it seems. And that Rolando Blackman miss. Byron Scott receives that pass. Cross court pass. Johnson is double teamed. Thompson, two. James Worthy with the alley oop. And that might do it. Rolando Blackman does miss that shot. Donaldson makes that. Put back. Free throw there by the Lakers. And the final score will be 119 115. The Lakers will take a 2 1 series against the Mavericks. Boston with the 2 1 series against the Washington Bullets. Does it seem like business as usual? Does it seem like things are going to unfold the way you expect? Well. I, don't know. <laughs> I want to spoil it so bad, but I won't. I won't because let's just keep watching the highlights, all right? Celtics bullets tied at 87. Game four. Larry Bird at the free throw line. Six minutes left to go. Misses the free throw. Mikhail with the putback. 89-87. Jeff Rulin to Jeff Malone. Makes that shot. Back to a tie game. Dennis Johnson handling the ball. Walton tells the screen. And Johnson makes that shot. Tie game at 91. Ainge to Bird. Bird misses. Roberts with the rebound. And here come the bullets. Xavier McDaniel passes it to John Stockton. He dribbles. Xavier McDaniel has the ball now. He passes the rule in the post. Who is going to make this bucket? Nope, miss it. And make this bucket. I Kevin McHale. 93, 91. Ainge to McHale. To Dennis Johnson for the bucket. Tie game. Jeff Rulin. Misses that shot. McHale with the rebound. Celtics in transition. And Ainge will get the layup to fall. The Celtics are up by two. Stockton misses that shot. Robinson with the putback. Back to a tie game. Stockton is going to pass it to Robinson for the dunk. Two-point lead. Bullets. And Ainge. Let's see what he does here. Passes that to Kim McHale. Gets it to Dennis Johnson for the bucket. John Stockton to Jeff Rulin. Is going to miss that shot, but he gets some rebound and put back. Back to a two-point game for the Bullets. Less than a minute left to go. McHale to Dennis Johnson. Tie game now. Rulin regains the lead for the Bullets. Dennis Johnson with Stockton on him. Passes out to Ainge, who misses that three-pointer. And the Washington Bullets get the rebound. Stockton dribbling. He's gonna. What's he gonna do? Drive the lane, miss, get his own rebound, and get fouled. So here is Stockton at the free throw line. Crucial free throws, both of them. Makes the first one. Let's see if he can sink the second one. He's automatic from the free throw line, so he does make both. And the final score will be 103 99. The Washington Bullets tie the series at two apiece. So that is quite interesting. 
Washington Bullets tie the game, tie the series at two. Robinson with 21 points is the leader for the Celtics in scoring. Stockton with 13 points, 12 assists. Danny Age, 23 points, 10 assists. Uh, game four, Mavericks looks like they're going to take game four and tie the series at two as well. So both of these series are tied at two as we approach game five for both conference finals matches. Bullets are at the Garden now. It's 98-94, 108-98 now. Five and a half left to go. We are at the Garden. B Bullets with three-point lead. A steal there for the Celtics as Dennis Johnson is going to drive and make this layup. One-point game. Robinson turns around. Baseline jumper is good. Back to a three-point game. Larry Bird. Stolen pass. Errant pass by Bird. Leads to Stockton in transition. He's going to pass to Jeff Malone. Stockton gets the ball back. Screen set up by Robinson and Stockton. Well, missed at three. But Robinson gets the rebound and basket. Five-point game. Larry Bird turns around. Makes that shot off glass. Dennis Johnson to Parrish to Bird. He's got McDaniel on him. And that is a bucket. 105-104. John Stockton pulls up. Makes that jumper. Three-point game. Kevin McHale with that basket. 107-106. 90 seconds left to go. Cliff Robinson is going to make that shot. Back to a three-point game. McHale cutting the lead, cutting the deficit to one there with that basket. Robinson drives. Draws the foul. Robert Parrish fouls him. And let's see if he can make these free throws. He makes the first one. And the second one. Oh, no, he misses the second one. Rebound McHale. Now the Boston Celtics have a chance here. To either tie the game or take the lead. Let's see what they decide to do. Danny Ainge handling the ball. Passes it to Dennis Johnson who drives. Draws the foul. Makes the first free throw. And I shouldn't predict whether or not they, he makes the second one because I, I, I seem to get it wrong. Misses that second one. 110-109. 46 seconds left to go. As is the Bullets try to Take time off the clock here a little bit. Robinson misses that shot, though. And the Celtics have a chance here. They have a chance. Ainge pulls up. Makes a crucial jumper. 111-110. Celtics with the lead. John Stockton with Dennis Johnson on him. Playing good defense. Stockton to McDaniel. To Malone. Stockton gets the ball back. Robinson misses that shot. Misses the two-pointer. And the f uh, intentional foul. Robert Parrish at the free throw line. Misses both free throws. Bullets call timeout. Now Stockton has a chance here. The alley-oop is not going to be good. And the Celtics will go ahead and win this game. Take the 3-2 series lead. Thanks to 26 points and 11 rebounds by Kim McHale. And so Celtics up 3-2. Let us check out game, what is this, 5? Mavericks, Lakers. Mavericks will end up winning this game, 111-101. And they have a 3-2 series lead. Very interesting. Very interesting. Bullets, Celtics, game 6. Bullets will go ahead and win this one pretty easily, actually. 126-102 is the final score there. So we're going. We have a game seven in the Eastern Conference Finals, and we're going to have a game seven. Maybe, maybe the Lakers can take this to seven games. Let's see. The Lakers' title hopes are on the line here. 104-104, 118 left to go at the Forum. Derek Harper. Tamar McGuire for the dunk. 
106, 104. Byron Scott passing it to Michael Cooper. Magic Johnson receives the pass. James Worthy gets the ball, gets the layup, tie game. Derek Carper with the miss there. Byron Scott gets the rebound. And here come the Lakers. James Worthy with the basket, 108-106. 22 seconds left to go in the game. Shot clock is off. Derek Harper. What's he going to do here? Dribbling a lot. Pulls up. Misses the shot. Intentional foul. And with these free throws, the Los Angeles Lakers are going to force a game seven, which, be, which will be played in, Los, in uh, Dallas, actually, because the, the Mavericks are the one seed. So we have two... Game 7s. Both conference finals matches are going to have a Game 7. This is what I was talking about. This is why this is quite exciting to have this happen. So first, let's check out Celtics Bullets to see if this is going to be a game we could check out. I hope so. It would be a bit anticlimactic if uh, this is a blowout. and It's looking like this is close enough that maybe we can jump into this and see how this concludes how this series concludes who's going to go to the Eastern Conference uh, no who is going to go to the finals I should say as the Eastern Conference opponent that's what that's the best way to word that I think and oof I think I simmed a little too far but 102 95 7 point lead Larry Bird makes that basket making a 9 point lead I wish I didn't sim that extra couple seconds Cliff Robinson misses that shot. Robert Parrish with the rebound. And I feel like we've caught a Celtics run. Hopefully it gets thwarted. Let's see. Kevin McHale is going to make that shot. 11 point lead. Let's see if the Bullets have anything left in the tank. Jeff. Jeff? John Stockton makes that shot. Larry Bird though. Passes it to Parrish, to McHale with the dunk. Back to low point game. Stockton trying his best. Misses that shot. Celtics rebound. Uh, and here's a stolen pass. Celtics in transition. And this is looking not too good for the Bullets. The Bullets are in trouble. Dennis Johnson to Kevin McHale for the bucket. 114-107, and that will do it. The Boston Celtics are going to go to the NBA Finals in 1987 as the Eastern Conference representative. The Bullets tried their best. They brought the Celtics to seven games. They fought all the way, but at the end, the Celtics are going to go back to the Finals for the third. Third? No, second season in a row. Was it three of four seasons, right? 84, 86, no, three of four seasons, yeah. So they this is the third finals appearance in four seasons for the Celtics as they hoist the Eastern Conference Finals trophy. And so who will the Celtics meet in the finals? Larry Bird at 28 points, Stockton at 16 and 14. The Bullets, I think they're going to be a thorn on the Celtics side for a long time. As that team is young and they're still fresh, Celtics are getting a little bit older. So we'll see how that how that rivalry unfolds down the line. Meanwhile, we got the Lakers, Mavericks, 85-81 in Dallas. Lakers with a four-point lead. Less than 10 minutes left to go. Derek Harper misses that shot. Donaldson, rebound, and the bucket. Two-point game, Magic Johnson. Brings it back to a four-point game. And here comes Mark McGuire. He's going to miss that shot. And the Lakers have the ball. Here they come. They slow things down. By Byron Scott to Magic. And it's 89-83. Eight minutes left to go. Mark Aguirre's teammate, Derek Harper, has the ball. Clumsy shot. No good. Mark Aguirre, though, is going to make that basket. 89-85. Check out this replay of Mark Aguirre getting the shot to fall. Blackman to James Donaldson. 
Off balance. Doesn't make that shot. 89-85. Lakers in transition. Here comes James Worthy with this bucket. And it's a six-point game. Derek Harper misses. Kareem Abdul-Jabbar with the rebound. And once again, the Lakers have a chance to extend their lead. As Byron Scott is going to take the shot. Draw the foul. Here come some free throws. Byron will uh, make this first one here. And make the second one, perhaps. He does. Eight-point game now. 93-85. Mark Aguirre to Orlando Blackman. That's a miss. Lakers, once again in transition. Is the game getting away from the Mavericks? In Dallas, game seven. Elimination game. Winner go home. Michael Cooper has the ball now. He passes it off. Magic Johnson has to, ends up with the ball, and he gets the layup. 95-85, 10-point game. Lundell Black makes that shot to stop that run the Lakers were having. But Magic Johnson, here he is. Close range, gets the rebound, gets the, gets the shot to fall. Back to a 10-point lead. Derek Harper. Misses, but Charles Barkley gets the put back. 97-89. Here come the Lakers. Magic Johnson. Good defense, but he manages to escape. 99-89. Little Black bin to James Donaldson. Gets the dunk. Back to an eight-point game. Four and a half minutes left to go. Mavericks are down by eight. Magic misses that shot. And here come the Mavericks now in transition. Let's see what they can do here. To Charles Barkley to Mark Aguirre to Derek Harper. Derek Harper is going to drain the two, making it 99-93. Four minutes left to go in the game. Byron Scott passing it to Michael Cooper, who passes it to Magic Johnson. Shot clock winding down. Johnson with the really poor choice to shoot it there. And the Mavericks get the rebound. And here they come. Barkley with the dunk right there. Four-point game. Kribil Jabbar makes that shot. 101-95 Lakers. Derek Harper pulls up. Misses. Mark Aguirre somehow gets that rebound. And the bucket back to a four-point game. Michael Cooper to Worthy. Makes the two. 103.97. James Donaldson makes the shot. The end one, perhaps, is good. 103.100. It's a three-point game now. Two minutes left to go in the game. Magic Johnson misses. And here come the Mavericks now. Derek Harper handling the ball. He passes it to Mark McGuire. Passes it out to Charles Barkley. Mark Aguirre gets the ball back. And Charles Barkley with the alley-oop. Making it a one-point game. 103-102. Byron Scott to Michael Thompson. No good. James Donaldson gets the rebound. Mavericks in transition. Lundell Blackman misses that shot. Worthy with the rebound. 103-102 still. 115 left to go in the game. Magic, Magic Johnson... Hailing the ball at the top of the key. He's going to drive. He's going to stop. He's going to shoot it. He's going to miss. Mavericks ball. Here come the Mavericks. Blackman to Derek Harper. He's got magic on him. On to Blackman. He's going to drive the lane. Miss the shot, but draw the foul. Let's see if he gets these free throws. The first one goes in. It's a tie game now. He could take the Mavericks could take the lead with this free throw. And it is a good one. Blackman with some crucial, crucial free throws. 104, 103, Dallas. Magic Johnson. Double teamed. Passes it. Worthy. To Michael Thompson. Michael Cooper gets the ball now. Shot clock winding down. Cooper with the shot. He's gonna miss. James Donaldson gets the rebound. Intentional foul again. Why would you do it this early? I'm not sure. But Donaldson gets that free throw to go in. With this free throw, it's a three-point lead. 
And that's what happens here. Mavericks go up by three. 25 seconds left. Magic Johnson gets the shot blocked. Michael Thompson gets the gets the shot to fall though. And here come more free throws. Mark Aguirre. Or no, Rolando Blackman, I should say. Makes those free throws. 108, 105. Magic Johnson misses. And the Dallas Mavericks get intentionally fouled. And uh, who is that? Derek Harper. Derek Harper misses the first free throw, but with this free throw, he can pretty much seal the game. The Dallas Mavericks, unless something crazy happens here, and it won't, the Dallas Mavericks are going to the finals to face the Boston Celtics. They beat the Los Angeles Lakers in seven games. A Dallas Mavericks team with Charles Barkley, Joe Dumars, Rolando Blackman, Mark Aguirre, Derek Harper. Uh, a great young team with a lot of fun young players. But they take down a Los Angeles Lakers team, a Showtime Lakers team that have made the finals in 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, five years in a row. The Mavericks have taken down the Giants. They've slayed the Beast to make the Western Conference Finals for the first time in franchise history. This this team was an a expansion team in 1981. 1981, their first year. It's 87, and they are in the finals against the Celtics. What an amazing development. And something that really could have only happened in this 40-year sim with, the, with the, the, the draft picks that they made. Barkley in 84. Dumars in 85, and Barkley is showing. I mean, if you, as, as evidenced by uh, this screen, these screenshots, Barkley's thunderous dunks, crucial rebounds have been uh, the, the that was the spark in this game. Barkley's energy, his dunks, turned things around. I mean, they were down by nine points, maybe more than that, ten points at one point in this game. With minutes left to go, and they rally back, they win. The Los Angeles Lakers are eliminated. And this, this, I mean, this has a lot of implications for the Lakers, but we'll get to them in another video because right now it's all about Celtics Mavericks. What a matchup! Very intriguing. Larry Bird, Kevin McHale, Robert Parrish against the young, up-and-coming Dallas Mavericks team. Can be very exciting as I make sure I save this file and yeah, because obviously I don't want to lose this uh, file, <laughs> right? But uh, yeah, what an amazing development! I'm excited to show you the finals. I'm going to show you at least the first three games. We'll see how things go, but I'm definitely going to show you as much of the finals as possible in my future episodes. Stay tuned for that. Study Sports Gamer. Goodbye.